Hey guys, it's JJ Fryer, and I know I've been a bit slack on my videos, but I'm finally back. And the reason for that is because I've released my book and it's out in the ethos now. So I've been a bit busy with that, but today I'm going to be reviewing something that I have been wanting to know, but I just was a bit procrastinating and that does not make much, much sense, I know, but I am going to be reviewing for you guys the Firebird series by Claudia Gray. Now, just a brief overview of the Firebird series without spoiling it. So, basically a young girl, well, I wouldn't say young, she's 18 and um, her parents are these physicists and they invent this incredible device known as the Firebird which allows um, the wearer to travel through the infinite multiverse through their consciousness and their consciousness enters these different personalities on different worlds and um, one day her father is murdered and her, and the main suspect is one of her parents' grad students named Paul. And so Paul takes the firebird and jumps into another, uni into another universe and Marguerite follows along with her friend Theo. And yeah, not everything is as it seems, obviously. And um... In yeah, the first book, which is A Thousand Pieces of You, was given to me by my friend, and I liked it. And uh, in all honesty, with this series as a whole, I enjoyed the string theory and how there were little plot twists, even in the parts where it wasn't an obvious, oh, here's the complication, or an obvious, here's the climax. And, um... The romance, I, um, to be honest, guys, I'm not a romance person, so it just didn't do it for me. It was too, yeah, for me. And but yes, if you like romance and string theory and science and all that jazz, do pick up the Firebird series by Claudia Gray. In my personal opinion, I would give it a 3.5 to a 3.75. I mean, the star meter has been a bit fluctuating with this series. So, yeah, that is all for today, guys. And I will be doing another video, which will be coming up later today. And until next time, guys, see ya.